What is up guys and welcome back to the Maths Guide. Today we're looking at column multiplication. Let's go. Okay, so in this example, we're gonna be multiplying a four digit number by a one digit number. And because we're using columns, we need to think about column titles. So my 2,452 has ones, tens, hundreds and thousands and I can put my 2,452 with 2,400s, 510s and two ones and then my five obviously just has five ones but by putting those column titles I've avoided making a mistake of putting that five in the wrong place. Now my tips are first to partition the question and then begin with the smallest value because obviously 2,452 times five is quite hard to work out. So I need to do it in sections. So let's get ready by putting my equals line and realize that I'm gonna be starting with this smallest value here, which is my five in the ones column. And I'm gonna multiply it first by two. Five times two is 10. Now I have a small problem because I can't put 10 just into this block here because that would mean I've got a 10 in the ones column and the ones should only have single digits. So just like any other column method like addition, I'm gonna separate my 10 by realizing that 10 has zero ones and a 10. So if I roll the 10 into the next column by putting it in the tens column and putting the ones in the answer row. Okay, let's carry on. Now I can do my five multiplied by five. Five times five is 25. But remember, I've got this one to consider now, so I'll add that on as well. So five times five is 25 add my one is six. So my answer is 26. And again, I'm gonna use exactly the same method, carry the two across, put my six in the answer column. Let's carry on. Now I have five times four. Five times four is 20, plus my two, 22. And finally, five times two is 10, plus my two is 12. I have nowhere else to go, so my one can just come into the answer row with my two. So my answer to 2,452 times five is 12,260. And you could see how quick that was using this method. But that was only a green chili challenge. Let's have a look at a slightly harder one. Let's look at a red chili challenge. But before we do that, let's think about subscribing to the channel, guys. If you're not a subscriber so far, what are you doing? There's loads of videos that come on this channel. Press the subscribe button to help yourself out. Let's get back to the red chili challenge. Okay, so red chili challenge is 2,912 times three. So I'm gonna do exactly the same. I'm gonna put my ones, tens, hundreds, and thousands label. Now I can see that I have 5,900, one ten, and two ones multiplied by three ones. Put my equal sign and I'm ready to begin. Where do I start? That's right, my smallest value, which is gonna be this three here. So I'll do three times two. Three times two is six. Now I move to the next smallest value, which is three times one. Three times one is three. Keep going with the same pattern. Three times nine is 27. So carry the two across, seven in the answer row. And finally, three times five is 15, plus my two is 17. So my answer to 5,912 times three is 17,736. Super efficient, easy method. Let's look at what to remember. Set up your columns correctly using the place value titles. This will help you make less mistakes. Begin by multiplying the smallest values first. And if a mini answer is greater than 10, we must carry into the next column, just like we did here with these numbers. Okay, your turn. Have a go at answering these red and green chili challenges and see how you get on. Press pause on the video now, good luck. And there you have it guys, that is how to multiply large numbers using column method. Hopefully this video was helpful for you. If it was, think about heading over to themathshelter.com to get all the help you need with maths. But for now guys, see you in another video, peace out.